How the hell do I get a gift from the heart? What the heel? Can I go in here? Oh! We... Town Hall. Can't interact with that. Sir? Responsible guard, Herbert. I'm not letting... I'm not letting anyone through here. Not even for... Money? Your bribe is a couple of zeros short of being useful. Fuck you. Secretive Secretary Linda. This is the Town Hall. Do you have any business here? N not as such, no. A lot of people come here with seemingly no business, and yet they stay. Uh, what do you mean? That's not for me to say. Well, I'm going upstairs. Hey! What's up? Cool bodyguard Dylan. The mayor's office is off limits to visitors, and before you try, I'm not open to bribery. Spoil sport. People on the computers. Smelly secretary Natasha? I overslept and had to come without showering first. I feel so dirty. Oh, I can help you with that. Bam! That smells so sweet, thanks! She begins covering herself in perfume. Not so smelly secretary Natasha. This money's for you. How much money did I get? Ooh, good stuff. She pays out. Creepy secretary Jordan. Day in, day out. It all blends together into a Kafkaian tale of horror. Sometimes I feel like an appendage to the mayor. Ugh, I'm gonna be over there, not talking to you. Just so you know, that only reinforces my theory. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you have anything? You know that body, that guard Herbert? He's obsessed with winning soda. He's the only person I know who drinks this stuff. Well, I know somebody that's obsessed with the winning soda, but we gotta check that other building out first. Enter. Super Duper Mart. Oh, cause now we can buy stuff. Oh, maybe the guy will give us like a soda. Like a non-winning soda. What up? You can go nope, nope, nope. I can't give you that much money unless I get a whole bunch of money from somebody. Let me see here. Who are you? Tomato lover Thomas. Man, I love tomatoes. I wish I could turn red and be one with them. Do I wanna know? No, it'll give you nightmares. Nothing in there. Beautiful girl Lisa. Jeez, I've got a lot to buy. Aw, isn't she cute? For a human, I guess she is. You furlessness. You furlessness always creeps me out. Your furlessness, Plutarch. Your furlessness. I've always imagined I'd look prettier if I was hairier. For the love of God, don't listen to him! Hmm. Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right. What can we buy? What do you need, unmotivated cashier? Nothing that you're offering with that attitude. Whatever. Can you believe this guy? Yeah, it's like that before having a dream. Come on, my good man. Things will eventually turn brighter for you. Just you wait. I, I need soda, pop. Need soda pop. Okay, so it's hard to get stuff. We need to get a gift from the heart. I don't think there's anything up here. Unless I steal something from a car. But... No. We can't do that. The cat. I do want to buy something. Actually, I was looking for something that would make a cat happy, but I'm running on a tight budget. Hmm. Sure, I have this gourmet cat food. This scratching post and this mouse toy. Each only cost $7. Okay, I'll take... Shit. Nothing. No... Toy mouse. Here you go. Also, take this magnetic pin with a calendar, so you'll always think of us for your pet needs. Thanks! Cat wanted a toy. I mean, it wanted... It wanted the mouse, right? So maybe a toy mouse will be the ticket. Magnet? Wait. Magnet? A fridge magnet advertising the pet store. A gift from the heart? Wait! 
Is that metal? Can I fish it up with a magnet? You point the magnet towards it, and the object begins floating your way! Oh, those puzzle solving skills. GSD! God damn! It's some sort of tool! I'm sure it'll come in handy. Oh, things are coming together now. Yes. It's all part of the plan. Sir, I got a tool for you. Uh, tool. That's exact. That's exactly it. Looks like I'll trade. It. Look, I'll trade it to you for this crowbar that I've been using to try and open the damn thing. Just don't use it for anything shady. There, it's all done. Now I can leave. I can't thank you enough, young lady. Wait, wait. Does this open up? Uh oh, more stuff. How big is this game? You're dressed kind of warmly for being on the beach. If it isn't Layla! Subject 02, name, Winters, Layla. Age, 19. Though she's so short, she seems younger. Skills, art. Additional notes, I love her hat. Do I know you? Well, not really, I mean, not yet. Getting creeped out already. No reason to. Me and my furry friend here want to make an offer to you. We're making a video game and we need a talented artist such as yourself to contribute to it. Leave me out of your childish games if you please. Huh, he's adorable and your offer actually sounds kind of interesting. So will you help me? It's all so sudden, but what the hell? Yeah, I'll help you as soon as I finish my current work. Will it be soon? Not really. You see, I'm in a bind. I'm trying to paint this lake, but I just can't find the adequate color to represent it. So if I found that color, you will help me sooner? I guess so, yeah. It's a deal. Well, how do I get that shit water color then? The crowbar opened it up. Nothing. Okay, let's go. Let me see here. Not enough zeros to pay off the guy. Break it with the crowbar. Uh, crowbar. Maybe this would be too much? Alright. Cat, I got a toy for you. My dead body feeling. Hey! What would make my cat happy? Toy mouse? What do you think about this, Don Whiskers? Indifferent man. I'm too old for toys. You heard the man. Shit! Refund, please! I'm here to change what I bought. Sure, what do you want? Uh, give me this scratching post. Here you go. All right, let's take. Typical cat. Okay, Don Whiskers. You want that scratching post, don't you? What do you think about this, Don Whiskers? Ah, uh, go fuck yourself. That is true. As a member of the Vipers, Don Whiskers spends most of his time outdoors, so he won't be using this much. It's not like I can carry it around. God damn you, you stupid cat, you fucking... Feed this fat-ass cat some goddamn gourmet cat food. What do you think about this, Don Whiskers? Joy is smelling. This is amazing. I guess it will pass. Well, seems you gained my approval. Great for you, soon-to-be Viper Sister. Hooray! Don Whiskers wishes you good luck in joining us. I hope he chokes on that food. I hope so too, Plutarch! He's a piece of shit. Hey, I got you... an apple. Tempting, but I already ate. I got you a magnet! <laughs> good one. Now where's the real tribute? Can't interact with much. I don't think you say anything. I don't have anything, I can't buy a winning soda for you. Is there anybody inside here? We were doing so well, and now I'm not doing that well. I've seen the mayor, he's planning something big. What is he planning? That's not for me to say. You! I'm not like anyone's rear, not even for an apple. I don't come that cheap. Not even for me Smacking you across the head with this crowbar? It's kind of cute you're trying to intimidate me. <laughs> I didn't mean to. Just don't do it. How about... 
this cool magnet. I don't like pets. You monster! Well, damn. No, 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 no. You don't need anything, you just say stuff like that. Spoil sport. Maybe the crowbar is for one of the ch the drawers we have at home? I can't remember if there was something that we couldn't open. Alright. What do we get? We got... Maybe it's stuck? Oh! There we go. Yeah, this is... <coughs> so what's in there? Just some glue. Maybe it'll come in handy. Looking good as always. How about we put some glue? Do I look healthy to you? Well, you are a little pale from all that time cooped up inside. But I think you're a healthy child. Thanks. A gift from the heart. How about some glue? This is the kind of thing you should be using to make me a tribute, not the tribute itself. Crowbar. It's a nice gesture, but I already have my own. How about some cash? We ain't gonna buy this rebel's heart. You gotta try harder. Apple? Oh man. Everybody doesn't want my stuff. Nobody wants anything I have. I don't even know where to go. Everybody's done. Everybody's done. Nobody has anything else. The only thing I have is some glue. And I can't give you glue. How about some glue? Uh, an apple. Just the other day, some men in white came by the mayor's office. Let me guess. It's not for you to say what they're doing. Actually, they were painters. The mayor is redecorating his office. Blah, blah. Redecorating his office. Maybe that's where I can get the paint. The truth is pretty boring. That's why I usually keep it to myself. It spices up the life of the people I'm talking to a little. You don't happen to know more about the painters, right? Well, they're keeping that ugly deep blue paint of theirs in the basement. And that's where it should stay if you ask me. Thanks! That's more than I could have hoped for. How the hell do I get into the basement? Oh, damn it! Is there something on the shelf? Different kinds of pasta. Very tempting. Too bad we can't buy some. Hmm, chocolate. I never understand you humans and your obsession with sweet treats. I prefer a fresh veggie any day of the week. You're a disappointment to me sometimes. It's filled to the brim with winning soda! Now how to locate the winning bottle. Magnet? You pass the magnet over the bottles until you hear a clinking noise coming from one! Oh! Now to buy it! Yes! Finally! That'll be five bucks. Here you go. Now to empty the bottle. I'm calling dibs on not drinking it. Hell, I'm not drinking it either. We could always throw it away. Maybe as a last resort. I don't want to waste it either. Your carefulness could cost us $500. No, 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 no. $500 and I can come back and get another soda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's on the shelf? Tomato sauce, ketchup, canned tomatoes. It's like a tomato aisle. Do you, they have fresh tomatoes? I think that would be too much to ask. Sir Plutarch is a sad rat. I thought you were a mouse, not a rat. Different kinds of comic books. You can't deny they offer variety. You have to get me some Iron Man ones later. Personal care products like deodorants are here. To my sensitive nose, all humans smell awful. Well, sorry for existing. You're excused. I think you need to tune up your sarcasm detector. I turn it off just to annoy you. <laughs> Son of a yeah, son of a it's a, it's filled with silverware and cooking appliances. I feel like screaming spoon might be way too dated of a reference. I know the re unless you're talking about the tick. You be talking about the tick? I know about the tick. There's some cheap clothing here. 
It looks like you're into... Looks, It's like looking into your wardrobe. I thought you were gonna point out some sort of confusion about the fact that humans need clothes. I understand it perfectly. I just enjoy the freedom of my nudity. Go figures. I get the nudist rat. And I can't check. Oh wait, I can! Bread, cookies, and other bakery products. Thanks, man. Okay. Alright. We have... We have the winning soda. Smells like feet. Rotten feet. Ew. So, I'll give you this winning ass soda for $500. Gizzling so non-stop. Contains a commemorative Star Wars metal pin. I just have to collect it. I've spent over $500 on this stuff, and I wouldn't mind spending double that just to get it. That sure sounds interesting. I can't give it to you? Just holding it makes you feel less lady- oh, no. Winning soda. It smells like feet, rotten feet. I guess I can't give it to you. I guess I have to give the winning one to the dude. What's the point? How about I give you this winning uh, soda? I'm not letting anyone in here. No. No, 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 no. Uh, whoop, whoop, whoops. So we give you the soda. Will you give us the pin back? I better save just in case. Yeah. What? Oh, Herbert downstairs is the soda fiend. I thought it was the guy upstairs was Herbert. Herbert, I got a winning soda. Is that a w winning soda? Tell you what, please give it to me and I'll look the other way around when you pass. Deal. Oh, delicious. It's even disgusting to look at. Here, you can keep the bottle. It kept the bottle. Whoa, what? The fuck? This place is creepy as all hell. Tell me about it. Why would the basement look like this anyway? The mayor's into some freaky shit. I bet this is where the mayor keeps those who cross him like trespassers. <laughs> Don't even joke about it. Empty winning soda. Congratulations, you win a team member. Ooh. Oh, okay. I thought something was gonna go off on there. Looks like that wall is fucked up. Where's the paint? Hey, m man. Janitor Orlando. You wanna borrow some stuff from here? Stick it to the man wherever it hurts most is what I always say. Or I would say if anyone came to talk to me down here. Tell you what. Since I'm so bored and you're desperate, how about you amuse me a little for it? All you have to do is answer a simple riddle. That'll be your key to looting this place. Sounds fishy. And I feel kinda dirty. But since I've come so far, why not? Okay. Here it goes. What starts with an E, but only has a single letter in it? What starts with an E, but only has a single letter in it? What? Um... Don't answer to me. Answer to the machine over there. Okay. But it won't open until you enter the password into the computer. What is the crowbar good for anyway? Just enter password. All in caps. I cheated! I had to Google it. I suck at riddles. No, no, no. We want... We want this. And then we want... We want this. What? No. And no, stop! Just pick it. I don't know why it does that. God damn it! Correct! Opening secure box. Give it to me. There are a lot of things here, but I only need this paint. I don't feel like boring anymore. Goody two shoes. Only a can of paint? That's a little disappointing. You can't stick it to the man with just that. Sorry. Computer, you're all right. Damn it! Can't believe that. I can't believe it. I should have known. I should have known all along. Anyway, do you want this stupid thing? I'll give it to you. Wait, you have it! Right there. Right here. Right now. $500 for it. How could I stay between a man and his pin? 
Yeah! 500 smackers. So we got the paint. Deep blue paint. Finally, we get our first team member. So did you find it an interesting color? Yeah, will this do? That's an exquisite shade of blue. It's perfect! I'm glad I live in the... What? I live in the 3026? Hemingway Street? Come by- Oh, the house number. Come by my house later. Will do. Team member got me. Damn right. Could you help me? I need to make a gift to someone. What kind of gift? I don't know, something sweet. From the heart, I guess. So it's that kind of gift, huh? Why do people keep doing that? No, it's just a regular gift. Can you do it? I'll even give you this to get you started. Uh... An apple? Delicious, but not very gift-worthy. How about... This magneto? Nice magnet, but I'm more... In the arts and crafts type of gal. Now we gotta get you something? Jeez! Maybe I didn't try hard enough. Maybe I should give her the glue. You can make crafts with glue, right? So, let's give her the glue. Okay, something sweet. Put something together for me. Oh my god! We should have just did that in the first place. That's perfect! Just give me a sec and I'll make something really nice. Ready, here you go. Thanks, I guess. What's it supposed to be? It's a beautiful bird. Now go out there and impress your friend with a true and original gift from the heart. See you later, new friend. Bye! Time to get me my stuff. Put together my own gang. My, my RPG Maker gang. Here, man. Handcrafted bird. This is just what I wanted. So beautiful. A lot of work and love went into making it. You pass. So we're part of the gang? So? <laughs> got my guitar. I actually didn't, but I got five hundred dollars that c should cover for the guitar and then some. You just giving five hundred dollars to me? That's how much this project means to me. Besides, I'm not rich, but they weren't that hard to get. Okay, you can count on my vote. Thank you so much. I thought I gave you an impossible task, but you made me happier than I could have hoped for. Well then, I can't believe it. You actually did it. Let me welcome you into the Tunnel Vipers. This is our secret handshake, don't forget it. So, now can I talk to Joachim freely? Finally? Being a Tunnel Viper is more than talking to each other. But yes, that's a good start. Yeah, don't forget about stealing from liquor stores and all that. We're no softies. We're... but we're not that kind of gang. Nothing to worry about, Plutarch. I just knew they were good guys. Ugh. Good guys. Joachim. So about my project. I'm in! I don't care what it is, I owe it to you. That makes me so glad. Still, you'll be making music for a game. Perfect. I'll make the best music you could hope for. Damn right! Gotten! Joachim, my talents are yours to command. Now, hook me up with your sister. What's the news, Sister Tungle Viper? Actually, I wanted to ask you something personal. Sorry to break your heart, but I'm taken. No, nothing like that. It's about your sister, Lucy. I'm pretty sure she doesn't swing that way. Ha ha. Will you let me finish? I have this, um, friend who is interested in her and would like me to speak to you on his behalf. Let me level with you. You're a viper sister, and I trust you. But this guy needs to earn my trust himself. Tell him. Tell him he can meet Lucy if he joins us. I want to test his character. He has to be worthy of her. I don't believe she needs your permission, but I understand where, where you're coming from. You want to take care of her. I'll tell Otis about it. Otis? That motherfucker. I hope your guy can live up to our standards. He will, don't worry. Alright. So, did you get the tape for me? Yes and no. 
Sebastian said he's willing to give you a chance, if you join the Tunnel Vipers. Me? A member of a gang? What would my parents say? Besides, they probably have some kind of violent initiation. No, this is too much. Don't you want the girl? The Tunnel Vipers... The Tunnel Vipers are good guys. In fact, I recently joined them, and if I can, I'll help you with your initiation as well. It's not that hard. You, you mean it? Oh god, a chance for a date with Lucy Simmons? This is almost too much to take in. So will you join my gang? You know, help me code my game? Of course! What are we making? An epic RPG about love, war, and betrayal. That actually sounds pretty cool. I'll work very hard to see your dream and mine come true. Gotten. All right, team. Let's do this. And so a team was formed. It was an arduous journey, but our heroine prevailed. They all started working hard in what would become more than a project, but a life-changing experience. Since this is not the story of how an RM game got made, but one about how a friendship was born. Because that's what game making is all about. Community spirit and camaraderie. I wish you have such a pleasant experience when developing your game. And thank you for playing. Credits, scripting, Yanfly, Wirlade, Modern Algebra, Lone Wolf, Galv, Mr. Trivial, Bravo to Kilo, music by Pike? Pisces? AKA Anderson187. Graphics Old School Modern by Dez. Enterbrain Sound Effects Sound Bible.com Enterbrain. Font by Sizenko Alexander Idea and Development Yawanda. See you next game. I will! I will. Wow. That was short and sweet. Well, thank you everybody for joining us on our journey to make a kick ass RPG Maker game. In this RPG Maker game, I had a lot of fun with it. I like having these short experiences. They're actually really fun. I get a good sense of fulfillment. It didn't drag on too long, but I got the gist of what the creator was trying to do. I really enjoyed the writing. Uh, for an RPG without combat, more of an adventure game, I I could play some more of this. I, The puzzles! The puzzles! The riddle! Oh my god, the riddle. I had to Google it. I've never had to do this for a game, but... You stumped me with that one. You stumped me with Miranda. So thanks, everybody. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time in the next game.